Hey you folks, YouTubers, shortwave listeners, ham radio operators or people who just accidentally surf by my channel. I'm your friend Uncle Gunther DK5ONV with uh yeah <laughs> with some new toy that uh, just got dropped off at my door. The, the day before yesterday on Friday this right here is the German clone of the legendary super antenna mp1 made by uh, whiskey 6 Mike 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 Alpha I believe he already went silent key I believe back in 2015 so this is the German clone by Defona Electronics in Offenbach, that's pretty, pretty close to uh, Frankfurt, not not far from here. And uh, I haven't tested it yet. No, I was busy, just too busy being fabulous, and uh, just prepared everything, because there's that coil. You got to do your adjustments. There is uh, some paperwork. Let me show you that real quick. And there's some paperwork, some instruction coming with it that um, that uh, just gives us some instructions. Where do we have to move that aluminum pipe? And underneath of that pipe there is the coil silver plated silver plated coil no copper silver plated i checked on it already so um yeah and it tells you the approximate position to each band to adjust so that means this antenna requires no antenna tuner okay so there is my antenna analyzer by Electronics. Uncle Gunther is old fashioned. He doesn't have no nano VNA yet. This here is um, about 27 feet of RG213 coax cable. I need to order thinner cable. This is really, you know, it's a little bit too heavy and a little bit too uh, stiff. I want more flexible cable, like uh, the Aircell 7. Europeans know about Aircell and Airflex and uh, Ecoflex cables. They are high power cables, flexible cables, and best performing cables. Here I got the two uh, jumper cables, number one. I need to test that if that still works. I checked it with the multimeter. Multimeter says everything is okay. There's a B and C block and uh, a regular PL block. So, um, and this is a regular coax jumper for SWR meters. No, actually, this is to drive your amplifier. That goes from the transceiver right into your amp and etc etc from the amp to to the antenna coupler and so on so uh, i want to test that cable that's why i got the baggie with all these adapters for the electronics antenna analyzer there is uh, some um Chinch coils in it. You can run it on a on your on a dip meter, and and so on. So, this will be my project for tomorrow, for Monday. Today is Sunday, September nineteen, and yeah. Weather-wise, all I can say is it's not raining. That's what it looks like right now. It's overcast and cloudy. 
The temperature is 73, 72 Fahrenheit. Hey <laughs> everyone, how are you guys doing? Tomorrow, on Monday, there will be a couple hours of sunshine. I mean, if I can believe the forecast of the weather app, it's all about the weather app, so no guarantees. But it will be pretty much like that. So you see, Uncle Günther got some business to do. And he wants to run that that buddy stick. And um, yeah, I'm super excited. I'm not going to stay the night out tomorrow. Um, because um, every time I want to QSY the band, I need to get up from my stool, I need to walk over to my antenna, and I need to adjust the antenna to the destination band that I want to work. So that's pretty stressful after, after the sundown and the dark, getting up every time if you feel like you as why this band is suddenly dead or kind of shifting and, uh, you know, so um, I want to run some tests during the daytime. I need to buy me uh, several uh, several markers for just color coding color coding the coil that makes operating in the fields a way easier. Of course, I will have that I will have that uh, manual here with me this way around but this is pretty that that pretty much sucks you know every time you eh, okay let's shake it up let's look inside of it where's 17 oh 17 meters is right this and then you you know and you go like okay 17 is pretty much here okay a little bit upwards a little bit downwards so i want to do the measuring job with the analyzer and then i'm gonna uh, I'm, I'm gonna color coding the coil and um, yeah well that that pretty much should do the trick so wish me luck folks and uh, so far so good it's Sunday and Uncle Gunther staying at home it's uh, I feel a little sleepy <laughs> no I, I haven't been partying or doing anything like that so I've um, been watching a lot of YouTube videos, man. There's so much up on YouTube about ham radio, about all kinds of things in life. and uh, uh, But 98% of uh, stuff that I'm looking up on YouTube is ham radio. 2% is about rock music and stuff. <laughs> yeah, it really, it really became that extreme. Uncle Gunther, he is so into ham radio, like... Pretty much nothing else in this world. Happy Sunday to everyone, 70 trees. Your friend Uncle Gunther from the other side of the world, uh, depending on wherever you may be. 73, stay safe. DK5 ONV, waving a hand.